This segment is brought to you in part by Southwest Washington Medical Center. Just because you've hit a certain age doesn't mean you're not still one red hot mama. You are, but in this case, we're talking about something not so glamorous, menopause. Are you confused about the change? Well, Southwest Washington Medical Center is here to help. I'd like to start out by welcoming Kimberly. Menopause, it's not a laughing matter. Don't throw anything at me. I'm not going through menopause yet. <laughs> Well, maybe it can be. Southwest Washington Medical Center wants to bring light to the transition. Women need to have education to empower them to take care of themselves. The third Tuesday out of each month is a girls' night out. A support group would be good. Yeah. <laughs> you know, you go home and, you know, what, husband, what? <laughs> he has no idea. So um, I think support, but also you know, things like how long does it last? What are some signs? Is this part of it or is this something else? You know, support group's nice, but I think mm -hmm. you just have to have the information. At September's meeting, women from all stages got a chance to get the facts from a real doctor face to face. People have things like hot flashes, night sweats, can't sleep. You know, that stuff goes away eventually, foremost. What do you do to handle that so that you, you know, you don't get um, sleep deprived or embarrassed or whatever it is uh, during that period of time. It's the kind of education that empowers women to outsmart menopause. About a, a little over a year ago, I had a brain cancer. So I had surgery to have, um, you know, all the parts removed. So it, the symptoms started coming and I didn't know what to do um, with them, about them, or how to deal with them. So it's been just research, word of mouth, and when Southwest started doing these um, meetings with Red Hot Mamas, I was just thinking, this is great, it'll be great up-to-date information from physicians, from other people, and the, the hospital putting it on, it was, I knew it was gonna be well-rounded. Most important thing is being around other women, because there's always kinds of tricks that people have and you, you can also uh, form some relationships there. Red Hot Mamas connects women, some in the middle of menopause and some years away, to talk frankly about the best and worst of what the change has to offer. You know, the sleepless nights are already coming on and, and the heat waves and things, but you know, not nearly like I'm thinking, I'm hearing about, so I'm scared. <laughs> oh, yeah, the hot flashes, they're probably the worst because they hurt sometimes, really? they, they're, they can be painful. It feels like my skin's burning. At the meetings, women share tricks on how they cope. For Kim Dabney, that means running the air conditioner at night to cool off a hot flash. My husband's really great. He freezes at night <laughs> so that I can stay comfortable. His side's like this high and, you know, I'm sitting there without blankets and just, you know, hot. These are the connections that help make light of the change. We want to live our last years, our last third of our life, in the best state of health that we can. And that's what an educational program can do. Because, you know, the doctors can't do it. It's people. For Better Portland, I'm Brooke Carlson. Hello. Find out about the Red Hot Mama's next event by visiting swmedicalcenter.org. Thanks for joining us. Better, we'll be right back.